Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. I hope you're doing very well. So today I'm doing something very exciting. I'm getting my husband to choose my makeup for me. So I have everything laid out and he's just gonna choose all the makeup for me just because I thought, let's see if we can make a crazy look today or something really awesome. So yeah, I've got everything laid out and yeah, I'm just gonna get him to choose my stuff. First, we're gonna go in with foundation. Which one would you like me to try? Um, let's go for the um, infallible 24 hour. Yep, so we've got this one. And then next is our setting powders. Uh, Revolution. Okay. And then we have our blushes next. These gorgeous, gorgeous pink, <laughs> pink blushes. Uh, let's go for the darker one. This one? Yeah. Okay. And then we're going for the highlighters next. These three gorgeous highlighters. Wet and Wild? Yep. Okay. And then we've got a selection of palettes, which are all some of my favourite palettes, but it's not my choice today. <laughs> okay. Got Jeffree Star at the top. Got Too Faced, Revolution, Colourpop and Essence just here. Okay, let's go for... Uh, kind of want to say Jeffree Star, but I will say... <laughs> That's alright, I haven't, it's been Maybe. ages since I've used any of these, but... This one at the bottom? Yeah, yeah, this is, is the Essence bit? one. Yeah. Is that okay? Yeah, perf perfect. Okay. And then, whoops, almost there. And then we've got just our mascaras left, and we have some lipsticks as well. Okay, mascaras. Is there a big difference in them? No, they're just really nice and lengthening, but I just thought I'd use mascara today. Something a bit different because it's so sunny. Okay, okay. Um, I haven't heard of this one. Kiko? Yeah. Okay, cool. And then lastly, we have our lipstick. So I've gone for essentially the same colours because that's just me. <laughs> but I'm happy to use any of them. This one's like a darker kind of colour, but then everything else is nice and red and bright actually this is pink yeah mm -hmm. um this one yeah the sparkly one awesome okay so that is my selection everybody and we're back so now it is time to put on the makeup so thank you very much to my husband for choosing all these choices of course a lot of these are some of my um everyday and my you know staple use products but you know we're just gonna carry on you know this palette i have not really use I've only used it once and it was like in a review video that I did I think it was a few months ago and then the lipstick um yeah is one that I have not really tried as much so let's get it on so again we're going in with the infallible 24 hour um, matte cover so this is one that I tried about two days ago I believe um and I actually put too much on. <laughs> I put too much onto my sponge, but today we're going a little bit minimal. So let's just get it on. So how are you guys doing this weekend? Um, today is, well, today I'm filming ahead. So today is Saturday, but you'll be watching this Sunday, um, hopefully. And yeah, I am basically spending this whole weekend, of course, inside and I had a great evening with my friends last night we did our taskmaster um that I've mentioned pretty much every like Friday video that I tend to upload or Saturday I talk about it um and it was very really fun of course like my friends again I mentioned put up so much effort to um like make sure that the tasks are fun and you know keeping us all kind of motivated throughout the week um and yeah, I'm just very excited for next week. Um, and we also have like little homework tasks, which I think are quite fun. Um, they, you know, I look forward to them a lot. So the one we have to do for next Friday is kind of, um, kind of replicate a film movie cover. And it's gonna be a difficult one for me because I am such a huge film fan and I like to kind of 
prove that not prove that I like movies but kind of like show off my movie skills because I've grown up in a family that love film um and just kind of like very passionate about movies so I um will be trying my best to kind of do a really good movie I don't know I'm going in next with my setting powder that he chose which again is one of my staple products and I've actually hit pan so I'll be buying another one very soon I don't know if I'll be buying this one I'll see if revolution have um any more powders I'm pretty sure they do because it's revolution and they're releasing products every couple of hours <laughs> it seems like that they just kind of upload like they just kind of like oh here's another product here's another product which you know it's pretty good and you know good to keep the company kind of like going and keeping customers coming back and stuff sometimes it could be a bit much but you know when you're reviewing products if you can afford it then you can if you can't then you just buy it another time but then it's still kind of relevant i guess it depends um i'm going in with the blush next and i'm going in with my spectrum brushes these brushes are fantastic i love using them they really pick up the product a lot um again this is a product i like to use a lot because it's very um pigmented and i love my red blushes so you know i like to kind of stand out a bit look a bit i'm trying to remember like what the character i think it's like pippi longstocking she has like really pink cheeks and she has like the the kind of long the <laughs> The, the braids and stuff uh, I'm going in with my wet and wild highlighter next again another staple favorite um that I love and yeah it's just and I've had this for ages and it's you know when you just make a slight dent the only thing I've kind of made a dent on is like the image um but then there's still a lot in that pan so I love that I love that highlighter so much here and has a good choice so I'm going in with the essence next um and this is primarily a kind of bluey green and I know I've got red lips but you know what it doesn't matter I'm not the kind of person to kind of like oh god this clashes this does that I don't I don't mind honestly it's just a bit of fun bit of makeup you know you can't take stuff too seriously um I'm going to go in with this shade here as a transition shade it's very white <laughs> so it's gonna be um basically like just a big staple color um yeah, it's gonna stand out pretty much so that's fine again with this palette there's not a lot of mattes to kind of um set in with which is okay i guess but you know it just depends on what kind of look you're after um i'm going in with let's go in with a dark shade let's go in with this little dark blue one in the corner and we're just gonna get this one everyone i'm just making sure that my brushes are nice to use um because i have a tendency of missing out some brushes when i clean my other ones but let's go in the creases with this and yeah the pigment on these are quite nice they're not the best but you know i've mentioned before essence is not exactly known for their kind of staple of like, pigment you know these um eye shadow palettes are very cheap I got this one in TK Maxx, so if you, um, I don't know if they're actually cheaper than, um, obviously they probably will be quite cheaper compared to um, actually going on either the Walkinsons website or even Essence themselves, um, because I think I got this for like three pounds and normally they're about five if that, but um, yeah, if you want a palette that is not kind of breaking the bank at all which is essentially essence and they have such a wide selection of palettes i really want to get some more um but of course not have to go anywhere right now but <laughs> when everything is open again i'll try and find some more essence palettes because they are they're quite nice i've had a couple in the past um one i actually really like but it broke but it's all right I'm just getting just building up this blue a bit because it takes a lot because it's, it's very shimmery um, and I'm gonna neaten everything up as well, so do not worry about that. This could be, I know I tend to be quite messy in the beginning, um, but I'm just gonna make sure that they kind of are similar. They're not that similar, but it's fine. <laughs> um, yeah, let's add a bit more on this side, and then we're going in next with we're going with like a shimmer. So I might go in with oh, let's go in with this silver. That's very nice. Um, again, my look is not gonna be anything decent. It's just gonna be. <laughs> 
um yeah just a look it's a look basically so we're gonna put her at the bottom here because we're gonna you know just not to use too many shades today which is fine because again this palette is very it's it's small um but yeah it's got one two it's got two mattes and you can't i mean you can go straight in with a shimmer if you want to um but it's just if you need a base to kind of start it off with just blending it into that first shade just so we get a nice glitter look and then we're going to go in with the second eye just go everywhere so this is a nice it's a nice silver it's pretty cute and yeah so good so far oh that's not actually the right saying so good so far i can't even talk it's really warm today it is saturday and i am boiling and you know we're inside <laughs> and it's hot it's crazy outside let me just clean up the corners and i'm gonna tidy up but i'm losing my mind slightly but that's fine that's cute I like it. It's a nice look. We've got only two shades, essentially, well, essentially three, um, but that white you cannot see at all. But it's it's very nice. It's a you know a cute palette like I've mentioned before. Doesn't break the bank. Doesn't kind of hurt. <laughs> it's yeah. It's a it's a nice selection and it's very um it's space themed so it's right up my street to be honest. So let's get the mascara on. It's Kiko mascara and it's cute also i want to thank everybody um who um gave me some advice on eyelashes so if you haven't seen my not the video on saturday but the friday video i put some lashes on pretty much for kind of the first time in like two years but it was actually me putting them on myself and i did not do a great job you know i did a decent job for someone who doesn't really know how to put on lashes but yeah I had my friends um give me some advice on how to kind of oh <laughs> on how to um apply lashes and stuff like that so thank you very much for those for the advice I will definitely be um you know taking that on board next time I want to um put some lashes on which might not be anytime soon but it'll be sometime soon I might have to buy some lashes some cheap ones and see how it goes right lastly wet and mild lipstick and we're just gonna put her on and look crazy i love it okay that's cute this was kind of part of their um essentially like game of thrones look um no not look so collection uh and it, yeah it's very nice these dry up very quickly and are very like matte so don't build them up oh i'm gonna stop talking <laughs> it'll just get a bit messy and these are a little bit patchy but uh it's all right it's good all right i'm gonna clean up at the bottom if i can because knowing me i will mess that up as well i know there's a way that people um oh no it's all right <laughs> but yeah this is the um finished look it's a random look but i appreciate it i like it i like the eyes the lips you know it's just about having fun with makeup and yeah i want to thank my husband again for helping me choose my makeup and hopefully in the future he might be on camera um but yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching today's video. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like and, like and subscribe if you have enjoyed this video. And I will hopefully see you very soon. Bye guys.